Give the building committee update, Madam and Chairman, uh, if you'd like me to proceed with that. I just pause and ask if there are any questions on any of the projects. I just rode by there. Couldn't see those coming in. There's not much activity there. Much activity. What was? I didn't see a whole lot. Roosevelt. Oh, at Roosevelt. Yeah. Yeah. I'll. I'll Go ahead. I'll, I'll give you a little bit of an update there for, for Roosevelt. Uh, just uh, a look again at our project critical path. Uh, since our last board meeting, uh, we completed a pre-construction meeting. Uh, we brought our building committee together with our architect our contractor and uh, the prime subcontractors. Uh, uh, we were able to work through our contract, establish some schedules of events for how we will now have ongoing meetings, and so that is going well. Uh, there is work underway in the existing building. Uh, painting is going on, and some repairs to some walls, some work that we're doing on the floors, so that is taking place. Uh, removing the wall to make the connection to the new construction that will go up. Uh, that wall has now been taken down. There was some reframing that we needed to do there. Um, we have uh, brought in the stormwater detention piping that needed to be installed to run down the side of the stormwater detention pond. That is now in. Uh, so there, there's been a good, good number of tradesmen that have been at work in the facility. Um, this just gives you a look at where we are going and what we're working towards as we move into 2014. You can see a couple of events there in early February with communications and IT equipment phased for the installation with the construction and renovations. Uh, the uh, uh, identification and order of any office or administrative or public meeting fixtures, furnitures, and equipment to support the interior design plan. And then uh, we're still looking at a certificate of occupancy on the 23rd of May with an installation of our FF&E complete on 20 June and a full relocation operation by 30 June of 2014. And that schedule is on course. Uh, these are some key events in December. We will have our first what's called OAC, Owner, Architect, and Contractor Meeting this Friday. That's where we come together on a monthly basis and we review the work that has been completed and then we approve payment schedules going forward to support that work that was done. We'll also do a landscape plan meeting with the OAC folks and the City of Aldosta to finalize our landscape plan and we'll do that on Friday this week also. So that's, uh, that's where we are today on 103 Roosevelt. And when are we going to see signage for the Project 103 Roosevelt? Uh, we're going to go through the final review of the landscape plan, uh, but we would not look for signage to go uh, in front of the building until most likely in the March, April time. Okay. But obviously the landscape plan, we know where the sign's going to yeah. go and we're that, landscaping that's, for the That's sign. correct. We want to resolve all those issues. We also want to make sure we get through any heavy construction and moving things around before we establish the sign. So it'll be one of the last things. We just haven't seen what it's going to look like or where oh, it's going to go. Well, we'll show you. We'll show you a concept for the sign for your review and approval, uh, most likely in the January or February. Okay. Just That's, since you showed us all these other pretty signs. We're going, to, we're, going to, see we're going to show you that one. We, we have a, a very, very nice concept that you like. Uh, we've got our sign folks working pretty hard to get these other signs out right <laughs> That concludes uh, my report. Thank you, sir. Steve, did you say something? Nobody. Okay. Okay, good. Executive Director's Report.